Hey guys, welcome back to the Parkerverse. With the uprise of some truly awesome AI platforms such as Dali and Midjourney turning any text that you type into an artistic image, this week I thought I'd share with you guys three awesome Android apps which will recreate their same functionality right within our palms, each one of them bringing their own twists to the AI space. Now before we get started, don't forget to hit that subscribe button so you don't miss out on the next one. And of course, as always, don't forget to submit your live wallpaper and home screen requests right from within the Epic Live Wallpaper app. Just head over to the live section and then click on the request button. And remember to boost your favourite ones using both the heart and the booster buttons here. Now all three of these apps will work in exactly the same way. Just enter in text format what you guys want to see in the image and the AI will do the rest, creating something truly unique just for you. So in no particular order, let's check out some apps. Photo Leap. This one is pretty simple, with a clean layout allowing you to jump right into your creations. Just simply enter what you want to see, select the style and then hit that generate button. It's basic, easy to use, and even better, while using it, I didn't see any ads at all. Now taking things one step further, we have Story AI. This one allows you not only to download the images, but also save your creations as projects, so you can later pick them up and continue creating right on top of them. And again here, you can choose from a multitude of art styles. And because it creates your artwork right within the cloud itself, you can easily step away from the app and do something else while you wait. Now even though it does take a bit longer than Photoleap, when it does get back to you, Story AI brings you 4 different takes of your requested image. Now sadly for this app, I didn't like how it forces you to sign up even before you can start using it. And on top of that, the fact that it works on a credit system to allow you to even use the AI generator itself really does put you off even if it does give you the option to watch ads to earn the credits. Now finally, we have Dream. This one brings a stunning user interface and the moment you open it up, you're welcomed by some truly amazing artworks, all created right within the app itself by other users. Now this one felt somewhere in between the simplicity of Photoleap and the in-depth functionality of Story AI. But even though this one does come with a paid premium option, it's fully free to use and doesn't limit how many times you can actually generate with it. Not to mention, the premium option also unlocks extra styles, allowing you to queue requests and much more. So now you've seen all three of them, which one is actually the best? Well, let's find out. First up, Cow in a Train. Girl on the Moon. Now for something a bit more difficult, man wearing a green jumper looking at a midnight sky in a city. And finally, how about for Into the Parkiverse. So what do you guys think? Which one created the best images? If you like this video and want to see more just like this, make sure to like and subscribe to help support the channel. And why not check out some of my Android customization videos. See you next time on Into the Parkiverse.